Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'll be making a chaka laka chicken. So we add one teaspoon of salt, one teaspoon of jera seeds. These seeds are usually used for Indian based dishes, but it works for this dish as well. Mexican chili spice, some chicken and bry spice. some black pepper you can use any spice for this recipe it all depends on you I just used these spices because I love the flavor with the chicken some garlic you can add as much garlic as you want as well mix all the spices together with the chicken make sure it's marinated perfectly let it chill and marinate for a few minutes you dice an onion be very careful when you're using a knife and dicing any vegetable as you can get cut Dice a tomato. Make sure you wash all your vegetables before you chop them up. You can use either one or two onions and tomatoes for this recipe. Now, dice the green pepper. You can use a green, red or yellow pepper or all of them for this recipe, just for a bit of color. Be very careful when you're using a knife, guys. It's very easy to chop a finger off. You don't want that. Place the chicken into a hot pan. You can use sunflower oil or olive oil. Make sure that the pan is nice and hot. Turn the chicken pieces around. Make sure both sides of the chicken gets browned. The chicken shouldn't stay too long into this pan. It should be at least 5 to 10 minutes. Just until that golden brown color. Thank you. 
Add onions to a hot pan. Let the onions simmer for about a minute. Don't let them cook too much. Then you add your green pepper, your tomato and a fresh red chilli. You can use any chilli with this recipe. Make sure you mix everything together. Let the onion mix simmer well. Add the grated carrots to the onion mix. Mix everything well. Make sure this mixture is not too fatty. Let the carrots simmer. Add your baked beans to the carrot mix and a quarter of a teaspoon of tomato paste. Mix everything together. Add a little bit of chakalaka spice. Add some curry powder and water and let it simmer. Place the chicken in an oven tray. Add the chakalaka mix on top of the chicken. Make sure you've got all of it for that amazing taste. Place the chicken in a preheated oven of 180 degrees for 20 to 25 minutes. Plate up. Add parsley or coriander to garnish your dish. Thank you so much for watching everybody. I hope you enjoyed the video and I hope you'll enjoy the recipe. Please do let me know about any other recipes you'd like to see on my blog. Don't forget to like, subscribe and comment down below. Please follow me on my personal account on Twitter and Instagram at Tumi underscore Chiquita. Enjoy!